So Matt, uh, three years ago you had 31 points in the NHL, then 45, then last year you had 55. I don't want to call it a breakout year, but it was definitely an all-star year. Just take us through your progression, I guess. Um, you know, at the first uh, coming into the American League, I wasn't sure kind of where I was going to fit in, and uh, you know, just started out, uh, you know, kind of third, fourth line guy. Whenever I get a chance to play, just you know, chip in and contribute to the team. And, um, I've slowly just you know kept that mind frame. You know, whatever, uh, whatever team may be on, you know, I'm a pretty versatile player. I can, you know, play, you know, a few different roles, and um, that's just kind of how I approach things. However, I can help the team, and if it's scoring goals, so be it. If not, uh, you know, I'm, you know, I'm, you know, pretty natural playmaking ability. And but uh, you know, I came into the league as a defensive centerman. And, um, it's something you know, that's kind of what gave me the opportunity to you know showcase some of my skills, and um, hopefully I can build off. Uh, Past three seasons, switching organizations. Do you think that helped you last year at all? Uh, yeah, I think just a fresh start was was nice, and uh, I think that um, you know when you know you have the same eyes looking at you all the time, uh, you know it's uh, you kind of get you kind of get labeled or you know kind of put in, you know pigeonholed a little bit. But uh, no, not, not that where I was prior to this, uh, they did that to me. But it's just nice to get a fresh start and uh, you know get get great great opportunity to play with some great players, and you know, I took advantage of it. Did you sense your success last season coming? Uh, yeah, I think that um, you know, prior to last season, uh, pardon me, two seasons ago, you know, I really wasn't getting the ice time. You know, I really offensively, I wasn't really given the opportunity to showcase myself and you know, score goals and be on the power play. You know, uh, and, you know, outside of a few injuries, I was lucky enough the season before last just to get a chance to play on an offensive position. And then uh, you know, last year I just you know. I had nothing to lose, and I still have nothing to lose. And that's just how I approach the game, and and try to play it uh, how I see fit, and um, just to use the skills I de I've developed, um, you know, along the way. You mentioned that within the AHL, your numbers have improved every year. So, how do you keep that trend going this year? Um, you know, I think that uh, this scheme um, rewards, uh, you know, humility and hard work, and um, I think that by uh, contributing. Um, to the team, whether it be you know killing penalties, blocking shots, scoring goals, winning faceoffs, just doing little things that, that help your team win and making the you know making the players around you better. You know, I think that's uh, kind of what I bring to the table, and I try to you know pull the best out of my line mates and um, like you know getting them to block, and the rest comes from there.